Hey, what's up everybody? It's Mike here. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to add a follower goal to Twitch. We're gonna be using two different methods in this video today. The first one is using the follower goal built directly into our creator dashboard on Twitch. The second, we're gonna be using the Streamlabs follower goal widget. And with that, let's go ahead and go to our creator dashboard on Twitch. We're gonna go over to Stream Manager. And then we're gonna to go to the right side here under Quick Actions should say manage goals. If you do not see manage goals, go ahead and hit the plus button. And then down here under grow your community, find manage goals, and then hit the add button. All right, let's go ahead and click manage goals. And right away, you're gonna see it's gonna hit you with uh, the very basic settings. It's gonna show what your current follower count is. And over on the right hand side here, you can set what you want your follower goal to be. You just go ahead and click this little pencil right here put the number that you want, hit the check mark. You can also add a description, completely optional. You can customize the progress bar as well, so you can select different colors. Then hit save. And now that Twitch has its own built-in Twitch alerts, you can set up an alert specifically for your follower goal as well. You can also see here's a preview. And down below, this is the browser source. This is the link that we're going to copy and then paste into OBS. So I'm gonna hit the copy button here. Also just wanna make note that they suggest that you set the, the dimensions of your browser source box to 1480 by 160. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit start goal. And let's slide over to OBS so we can add the browser source. All right, once you have your scene selected, go into your sources box. You're gonna to wanna to right click, hover over add, then select browser. And then let's go ahead and give it a name. Hit OK. And then right here in the URL box, you're gonna go ahead and paste that link that we copied over on our Twitch dashboard. And then we wanna also set it to 1480 by, oh God, what was it, 610? On 16, that would've been awkward. Hit OK. And there you go. There is your follower alert. You can go ahead and resize it however you need to. Um, and yeah, you can just copy that source and put it to whatever other scenes that you want. And while the Twitch follower goal doesn't really leave a lot to be desired, it's pretty simple and, you know, obviously not as fleshed out as the Streamlabs follower goal. But one cool thing it does do is it adds the follower goal directly onto your about page. All right, next let's go over to Streamlabs' website. Go ahead and open up our dashboard. If you do not have an account, I would suggest creating one. And then let's go over on the left-hand side here where it says all widgets. And if you look down here, you'll see follower goal. All right, some pretty basic settings to start. You can set a title if need be, a goal amount. Unlike Twitch's website where it shows you what your starting follower count is and then being able to add where you want your follower goal to be, uh, I, you can set it as simple as I wanna get 100 followers in a week. All right, the starting amount's gonna be zero. And then end after, we'll just put a week out. All right, and before we start the goal, let's go check out the settings tab. And here's where the Streamlabs version is a little bit more fleshed out than the Twitch one. Uh, you can change the layout from standard to condensed. You can change the text color as well if you wanted to. The bar text color, the bar color itself, and the bar background color. You can change the bar thickness. Pretty thick. And you can also choose which font you wanna use as well. And then obviously if you have any type of custom HTML or CSS you wanna add, you can do that as well. And let's go ahead and hit save settings. Let's go back to the manage goal tab and start the goal. All right, there we go. And kind of like how we did with Twitches, we're gonna go ahead and copy this widget URL. Let's go ahead and hit copy. And let's go ahead and slide over to OBS. And just like we did last time, let's go ahead and find the scene we wanna put our follower goal onto. Go to the sources area, right click, add, go down to browser. Once again, add a name. And under the URL box right here, let's go ahead and paste our widget URL. And there it is. To go ahead and resize as necessary and you are good to go. And those are just two real simple and easy methods of adding a follower goal to Twitch. 
If you would like a written version of this tutorial, go ahead and check down in the description of this video. You'll find a link to my website with just that. And if you'd like to check out my Twitch stream, we also stream on Friday and Saturday. Always some crazy stuff going on over there. All right, what do I do with the deer now? Do I like do I skin it? Kill the what bear? Oh shit, God, dude, that's, I'm a baby. I'm nine months old. I can't kill a bear. But I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you very much. Hope you guys like this video. If you found it helpful, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.